We just arrived in Germany in Cologne and um, this is my hotel room. Don't mind the mess though because I just unpacked. It's kind of cool. Bed is really comfy. I'll try to vlog uh, some things for you guys. I haven't done this before so don't mind me if it's not going correctly right away. Um, yeah, so tomorrow the first day of FIBO. I've never been to FIBO ever and um, especially not with body engineers so it's gonna be super fun and um, yeah right about now we're going out. We're going out. We're going downstairs to uh, have a drink with the team and just chill because we drove here like three hours and I almost fell asleep behind the wheel and got an accident but it was okay. So um, right now I'm going downstairs and um, I will vlog the rest uh, of the trip for you guys. Good morning everyone. I just woke up in Germany. Uh, I didn't sleep so well only for five hours but it was okay because yesterday we had a nice drink with the team and um, it was just a little startup so it's fine. Today the weather... I hope we're gonna have some sunshine because I really need some just to wake up. So right now the time is 8 o'clock and I need to go and hurry and prepare myself for FIBO first day. Ah, okay, I'm going to wake up. Look what Janita is 
still in the car, driving back. Oh, yeah. So tired. Yeah. Well, you still alive? Yeah. Still alive? Andrina, what do you think? I'm mad. What do you think? I'm mad. Fuck this gym. Having some Jerky. With spinach. What do you have, Anya? Red snapper. Mmm, looks good. <laughs> hey guys, so I just got back in my hotel room. It's kind of dark in here, by the way. Let's go to the bathroom. Ooh, get that lighting. Um, let me see where do I put this. Something like this. Okay. So, <laughs> yes, I'm sitting here on the toilet. Um, about today, it was really cool. For the first day, it wasn't that busy because on Thursdays, it's, yeah, it's just not that busy. It's easy as that. Um, but yeah, it was an amazing day. I hope you liked it um, because for us it was pretty overwhelming and thank you guys for coming. Today something bad, react, yeah, very bad happened at the, at the booth because there was this guy who was in a wheelchair. Um, so yeah, people got up there to take pictures with us and everything and he wanted to do like the, the flex pose, you know, with one of our athletes. And um, the guys picked him up from his wheelchair and it was, he, he did like the flex pose. Um, but what actually happened, he got an epileptic attack. This one guy that was next to him, he didn't know him, but he just was trying to help him and um, put his finger in the mouth of the guy who had the epileptic attack in order to prevent that his tongue would go in his throat. Let's go on lockdown. Um, so, that happened while the finger of that guy was still in his mouth between his teeth so he started screaming and screaming it was uh, it was terrible because he we couldn't open the jaw anymore but his finger was in there Whew, it was so bad so um, but what the guy did was he got a pen and he put it in between the mouth and he took his finger out but no uh, before this I used to work at the police so yeah I, I do know what to do in those kind of situations. So I put him in a side pose and what that actually does is that it frees the airway and his tongue is not able to slide down his throat. So we were just waiting for the paramedics and everything but the whole happy vibe was just gone. It was it was just terrible because you don't want something like that to happen of course. 
So after, I think even 10 minutes, it took a long time for the paramedics to come there. They came there, uh, checked him, and then he woke up again. So that was really good. We were really happy that he just woke up and eventually could even uh, get up his wheelchair again. He uh, filled the whole BE bag with some clothing, snapbacks and everything. And of course, it's, it's nothing in those kinds of situations, but it was just nice to give him something and... Yeah, let him know that he's appreciated because he comes by the booth to see us. Um, so yeah, that was pretty good to just give him that. So uh, yeah, he went with the paramedics and eventually he was fine. So. What you think is interesting, Gil, um, just let me know in a comment. I've never done this before and I really hope you guys like it. I hope I sleep good and then I'm gonna vlog again tomorrow for day two at FIBO.